<laughs> Alexis McGinnis picks up a win at number four singles to help Shenandoah move on to the final four. Alexis, you guys are going to the final four. How's it feel? Feels great. <laughs> Just take us through your match. Uh, did it go the way you drew it up? Yeah, I think so. It was a little closer than I thought it was going to be. She did a lot of lobs, so I just had to stay consistent and get them back over. What do you think the, the difference maker was for you in that match to be able to prevail and get the win? Um, I think maybe hitting some harder shots when she lobbed it because like, if I hit it at her feet, she couldn't get it back over. Looking ahead to the Final Four, obviously you guys don't know where or when you're going to play, um, but just how excited are you to get there and what do you want to do, do when you get there? It's really exciting. That's our goal for sure, to get to the semifinals and then to the finals. And then I think we just keep working hard uh, one by one every practice to get to the finals. Nicole Gilbert picks up a big win at number one singles to help Shando get to the final four. Uh, Nicole, just what's going through your mind after a dominant duel win for you guys? Um, yeah, that's great. Like coming in, uh, we knew they were going to be a good team, and to be able to do that was awesome. Now on Saturday in the the um, against Pella, you dropped your your match. Um, how hard was it for you to come back and and get ready for today after a heartbreaker on Saturday? Um, yeah, obviously um, didn't go how I wanted, and she's a really good player. But um, I'm thankful to have my team who um, helped me pull me through, and you know they just give me a lot of good support, and as well as the coaches. So they got helped me get ready for today and just told me that I could do it. So Anything in particular today that you felt like uh, you did a lot better maybe than Saturday that was a difference maker or things that just went your way today that didn't go Saturday? Um, not particularly, just some more shots fell in, you know, two different players. So I had to change up my style a bit, but yeah. A couple years ago, Shando made it to the Final Four. You remember that team as well. Uh, just what do you remember about that experience that you hope to take into to this experience? Um, yeah, last year we got, or not last year, two years ago we got went to Final Four and I played on that team as well. And um, just being there and the whole experience is really awesome. So the hunger to get back there was, was really um, a big deal this year. And I think being there a couple years ago, not making it last year even pushes our hunger even more just to you know, compete with the top teams and do well. So. All right, Coach, 5-0 dual victory today to advance to the Final Four. I'm sure it's exactly how you drew it up, right? <laughs> yeah, no, we, we felt prepared and, um, you know, it just ball rolled the right way today. What do you think some of the difference makers were, some of the difference makers were for you guys today? Um, you know, I, I think just our preparation is um, kind of what it was last time, too, just uh, Again, after the last match, what was it that um, we need to do to focus to um, be successful in this one? Um, little errors you can correct here and there, but there wasn't anything different than what we have done all season. Just getting here, getting out, getting ready, getting prepared, and, and playing tennis. Two years ago, you guys made it to a Final Four. A um, couple of faces that were on that team last time, uh, the Gilbert sisters, but for the most part, it's a pretty new team that's getting to the Final Four. Uh, what's that say about the program in Shando the last couple of years? Well, I, I, I just like the way that um, the girls just keep coming out and playing. So um, whether they're playing with their parents or they're playing with, um, you know, kids in their grade or the boys team or whatever it is, we're getting tennis going in Shenandoah, so that's awesome. To get to the Final Four next week, uh, what do you expect or what do you want to see from your team? Uh, fight. Uh, just what they've done um, so far is what I want to see. And I, I think that um, playing each, you know, team presents different challenges, and so um, we've got to do a little bit of asking around to see what these teams are like because although we know who they are, we know they're good, um, we haven't seen them in any match play. So it'll be um, fun to um, get an opportunity to play somebody different and uh, present those challenges and take them down.